take. Oh, Cabrera just had a little bit of a twitch there on the start line. Great start from Wozniak, but here comes Bewley, roaring round the outside. That's poetry in motion from Bewley. He loved that. Got his back wheel in the dirt and the bike powered himself to the front. We've now got Cabrera and Wozniak fighting for second place. And guess what? Freddie Lingwin, he's out the back. Beauty out in front, though, and a good battle for second. Uh, when Dan Beauty is flowing on the bike, there's no one better to watch. But I tell you what, he's coming under a lot of pressure from Simon Wozniak. He would do nothing better than to, to, to take the lead in this race in front of these Polish crowd. He looks like he might do it here. What a ride. Wozniak hits the front. Beauty chops back to the inside. Repays the compliment. We've got less than a lap to go. Simon Wozniak riding out of his skin here. He has ridden a stormering in his opening ride. Heat number four. Simon Wozniak out of gate number three. Stunning opening ride from him. Freddie Lingwin also coming through. Start Marshall walks away. Tapes are up. Boom, away they go, Holder's there. Here come Doyle around the outside, Cabrera's with the meat and the sandwich, but Mickelson coming through. Doyle down the outside, but it's Holder. Holder now being chased hard by Jason Doyle. Doyle's got his wheels in the dirt. He's going to fire himself to the front. What a ride from Jason Doyle. Yeah, fabulous first lap from Jason Doyle. He's always just sticking with the wide line. Ooh. Oh, Jack Holder nearly <laughs> got back up the inside. Jason Doyle had to work really hard to find all the extra traction that he needed. And now Jack Holder switching to the outside, looking for a cutback. Doyle out in front, looking to go back to back. He victories in his first two heats. Fabulous move down the outside. Jack Holder working overtime in second place. Mickelson's not out of it. Mickelson running high and wide, generating lots of speed on the last lap. But Doyle now, conservative around the last corner, going to pick up a large one. Look at Mickelson. Mickelson's still second place on the run to the line. Oh, Jack Holder's going to be gutted about that. So, can he win from the inside? Hasn't been that fruitful, the inside gate. Takes her up, drops the clutch beautifully. He's fired himself to the front. Here we go around that first corner. Certainly Kai Huckenbeck looking threatening down the back straight. Coming on strong. Now Bartosz Schmalzlik responds. Runs wide. Look at this on the inside from Leon Madsen. Oh. Now the German hits the front. Oh, what a race that was as they completed the first lap. Down the back straight again. Oh, Kai Huckenbeck almost collecting Bartosz Schmalzlik. Fabulous speedway here. Smarsnik managed to get himself back to the front. Unbelievable opening lap and a half there of Speedway. And uh, we can see now Madsen and Huckenbeck. Huckenbeck in the thick of the action. I don't know how he stayed on the motorbike going into turn three there. Lap to go. Bartosz Smarsnik out in front. Having to work overtime to get there. Coming through in his second place. Huckenbeck with Leon Madsen back in third. But the champion having to really lay it down. Again, Doyle's unbeaten. Here we go then. Oh, Doyle's moving all over the place. Missed the start big time. Nevers got there. Look at Doyle. Doyle's oh, come from move. nowhere. How on earth has he done that? Freddie Lingwin now up the inside. Fabulous speedway in heat number 11. Doyle back to the front. What an opening lap of speedway in that. It doesn't get better. I tell you what, Jason Doyle almost did himself a favour by moving there because he gave himself a lot of room to make the cutback. On that corner, it looks like he's going to have a run up the inside. Lingwin now moving wider, wider, wider. Lots of traction out there, generates lots of speed. A little mistake there from Doyle, and it's Wuffenden at the back. Yeah, Wuffenden's at the back. Sensational opening, couple of laps of speedway there from the boys that are in second and third in the World Championship. Freddie Lingwin has really turned on the start here. Look at the determination. Lambert's coming on strong. One last blast through the last corner. Lingwin's going to win the race. He's had a win and a second and a last. Wow, that is some star from Wozniak. Absolutely flew out of the gate. Textbook stuff from him. Through in the second place is Jason Doyle. Leon Madsen's on the outside with Shiniak. Look at Doyle. Doyle coming up the inside. Can he hit the front? Yes, he can momentarily. Wozniak and Doyle neck and neck for first place. What a corner from Doyle. The Australian riding out of his skin there. Gets himself to the 
the front. A uh, forceful ride from Jason Doyle. That's what we're used to seeing from him. I thought he'd actually move Wozniak out into the dirt. I thought Wozniak would have the speed to get back around him. But Jason Doyle seems to have found a setup. It's working very, very well for him. Race is settling down now. Madsen trying to put Wozniak under pressure. Jason Doyle riding superbly well out in front, riding very wide now. Wozniak a little bit out of shape, but he's hanging on there in second place. Matson's on the pace, but once again, not in the big points. Doyle, though, he's on to 11. He's dominating the Grand Prix here in the Nanadobi. Tapes up. Where we go? Looking back, trying to get there, but look at all. Doyle a bit hard on Hookenbeck here? <sighs> I, I, I'm not really sure, because if Holder hadn't have been there, Hookenbeck wouldn't have fallen off. So That's fair comment. You know, it's it's just it's three riders all going for the same little bit of turf. I'm no afraid. exclusion light on, though, Chris. So let's keep our fingers crossed we see them all fall back. And we are hearing yeah. the stadium announcer has at least said it's all fall back. I don't know why they get the information before we do. We're obviously a little bit further down the line. <laughs> but in truth, um, well, we nice. called it anyway. We, we knew what it would be. It's a hard, hard ball there. Oh, that's a typical collarbone-type crash. Well, you're right. We're about to find out. Second time of asking. That takes her up. Doyle's made a fabulous start off the inside. He gets there, but Holder. Holder's made that bike work. Oh, that's tight. tight. Down the back straight. Jason Doyle did so with Doyle. Oh, Holder's in trouble. He's gone wide. Lammers comes through in the second place. Driver there for Jack Holder, but Doyle's out in front. Tell you what, that was a wise move from Jason Doyle to move Jack Holder out. Of course, Jack's leading the championship, and this oh, could have a massive Doyle. effect on it. <laughs> Doyle's oh. leading in the fence. How did he hang on to that? Fantastic action for Holder's second back and third. Through. Holder's come through in the second place. He got the better of Lambert. Lambert now having the door slammed shut. It's an Aussie one, two out in front. Fantastic semi-final here, the first semi-final. But Doyle, where he's accustomed to being all night long, is going to win the first semi-final. And he's through to the final. Oh, my goodness, it's tight for second. Green line is on wall, takes up fast, and the poles were away. Wozniak. Wozniak hits the front, Martin Vasilik round the outside, Smarslik covering that move, electing to go wide. Wozniak made a fabulous start from gate number three, but keep your eyes on Bartosz Smarslik, who hits the front now. The roar, the crowd, the roar from the crowd is impressive. Wozniak's not out of it, though. Look no. at the grip he's got. Coming off a turn, number two. And Bewley's now mixing it as well. He'd made a disastrous start. Martin Vasilik now round the outside. Whoa! From him. What a ride from Martin so much and, speed. And Beauty's now coming to third. Martin Vasilik, dramatic speed from him. Smiles the out in front with a lap to go. Got a feel for Wozniak, who's now at the back. But for Bartos Smarslik, he's going to cruise through to the final. Probably his best ride of the night. Here comes Martin Vasilik through in the second place. And Smarslik's in. Greenlighter's on now, tapes her up around the way, great start from Doyle, here comes Smarslik, Smarslik's gone very wide, brilliant corner from Doyle, Doyle stretches a march down the back straight, he hits the front, Lambert's through in the third place, but Bartos Smarslik in second place, he's going to hunt Jason Doyle down. Yeah, Jason Doyle cannot afford to make any mistakes. Riding well, bikes working well, he'll be hearing the chains, he'll be hearing the motor. Schmarslik doing all he can. Second place in this Narodome Stadium tonight won't be enough for him. But Jason Doyle is doing everything right at the moment, but Schmarslik waiting to pounce. Jason Doyle, just over a lap to go, has ridden superbly well. He's into the last lap, less than 270 metres to go. Bartos Schmarslik coming on strong second place. One last blast down the back straight. Jason Doyle through the last corner and he's going to be a Grand Prix winner once again. Doyle wins in the Narodome. What a fantastic moment for him. He's been the rider of the night. Always off the oh, bike down the back straight. That's a little embarrassing. Such embarrassing but I don't think he cares. No. What a night. He's happy with What that. a night. 
He's had seven rides, he's had six wins. He had seven rides two weeks ago. He didn't have any wins. No, it's uh, polar opposites for Jason Doyle, but he doesn't care. He doesn't care, he's throwing the bike down the tracks. He's on top of the world at the moment. <laughs>